Well, a lot of people sit around and think about how they can help the less fortunate, but officials with the Himalayan Institute in Holmesdale are turning those thoughts into action. As TV 13's Jen and Murphy reports, a small town in Africa will soon have more than they ever thought imaginable. Oh, it's amazing. In fact, it's, it, this has really kind of gone beyond, um, you know, a Himalayan Institute project to a, a whole Honesdale project. We Officials with the Honesdale Himalayan Institute, Rotary Club, and Wayne Highlands School District are sure getting a good workout today. They're in the process of loading a 40-foot trailer filled with everything imaginable to build a community center in Cameroon, Africa. Those hundreds of boxes include 25,000 donated books, which will be used to make the first ever public library in the region. It's, uh, it's amazing to make a, a real lasting difference and it's so challenging to do. And that's the whole goal of this HI Community Center empowerment and uh, finding a way to uh, bring forth a lasting social regeneration. The center's purpose is to bring stable employment into a town that has over a 95% unemployment rate. And if you're lucky enough to have a job in Cameroon, a day's pay is a whopping two bucks. The Institute, by setting up its community center, really brought uh, work in the, in the sense that they are able to not only manufacture and create things like jewelry or do farming, but they are actually empowered. It's not that we just gave them something to do. We gave them something to do that they could earn money from and earn a living from. This trailer has a long trip ahead of itself. In about a week, a truck will come here and pick it up and take it to a port in Newark, New Jersey. There it will be placed on a ship and sail across the world, but it's not quite that easy. From Newark, it'll ship uh, to Belgium. From Belgium, it'll ship to Ivory Coast, Ivory Coast to Cameroon, and it'll get uh, offloaded in the port there, and then it's a 10-hour journey all the way north to where our center is. So it's a long journey. It'll take about two months and 10,000 miles. Officials say it's a lot of work, but it's all worth it as soon as they see the smiles on the faces of the African families and children. Reporting in Honesdale, Shannon Murphy, TV 13 News. And that's going to do it for the Pocono Report. Stay tuned. The Valley Report is up next.